All right, so today what we are going to do is we are actually going to unbox and test out the Milwaukee M12 Tough Shell Jacket. Now, this thing is awesome. Uh, I have the M12 hoodie. I'm not a fan of it. This thing is, I'm not sure if I got a return, but the pockets are that are in front are way stretched out, so I think I got a return. But when it comes to the hoodie, I'm not a fan of this thing. It's just not well that well made. Are they actually had this on display at my Home Depot, and I uh, I tried it on. I felt it. It actually feels like it's a highly durable and tough jacket. It's a very thick material, and I love the way it it felt when it was on me, and it and it's heavy. Now I'm not like, and like I said, I'm not a fan of the M12 hoodie. This is just cheaply cheaply made because what I actually did is I did some more research, and a company called uh, this was not sent to me. I bought this. A company called Milwaukee Leather actually makes an extremely good hoodie. This thing is heavy. Uh, the 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 material is much thicker than the M12 version. This is also a heated hoodie. It comes with its own battery, and it's also a USB charger for uh, USB micro and USB. And also, what I, I did test this out. This actually works with the M12 batteries. And so after. Uh, after I bought this and tried this on, this is not going to be used at all. That's just going to be sitting in my closet from here on out because this one, because this hoodie is awesome. And so, like I said, it's much, much thicker material. It has extra pockets for headphones and stuff, but I wanted a, a heated heavy duty jacket. And so that's why I got this because I'm going to wear this underneath a big coat during winter. Like with, when it gets in the negative, uh, in the negatives. So let's unbox this really quick. Uh, let's see what this is like, see how this version actually is. And yeah. Of course it comes with a catalog. I'm not sure if any of the new stuff is on it. That's coming off for pipeline. I doubt it. And so yeah, this does come with a two two amp hour battery, which you're probably gonna put the, probably put that on charge. Actually, I, I have one out here. Instead of the actual M12 uh, regular charger, it comes with this one. It comes with this charger. You know, you just put it. Uh, does come with its own USB wall, uh, wall mount, a USB charger, which is good. Two USB micro. A nice heavy duty cable, so yeah. There you go. Now, in my opinion, just because to make it that much better, they sh this should come with a three amp hour cylinder battery, you know, because a, a Milwaukee M12 makes two M uh, three amp hour batteries. They make the cylinder one, you know, they, they make this one, and they also make a, a three amp hour cylinder battery. So I think that this should make, uh, come with a three amp hour battery instead of a two amp hour. There you go, it's always good to have an extra battery and I already have one charged up right here, which this is my favorite flashlight. I love this thing. This flashlight is awesome. Official Milwaukee brand wall charger. Look at the jacket itself. That is, that's nice. This thing is heavy. That's, that's heavy. I like that. This is seriously, it's seriously a nice, uh, nice jacket. And it is brand new, so I get, I, I'm guaranteed it's not a return. And yeah, that, that material is, I like that. All right, so this is the M12 heated gear, made for uh, Brookfield, Wisconsin. Doesn't say anything about the material. It's when you do surgery. This is washable. It is, I already did a test video. I'll put it uh, right here. It is machine washable when it comes to the hoodie, so this would be as well. And so yeah, this is a much better quality uh, jacket than the than the hoodie. The, I do not recommend the hoodie at all for you to get. If you're going to spend the money, get the jacket. That hoodie, it's not garbage, but it's they, they could have made it better like they made this. This thing is a very well build. There are three mode settings with a 2 amp hour battery and 8 hour runtime, And of course it is washer and dryer safe. 
and yeah. And so I'm assuming that is the eight amp hour runtime is with the two amp hour battery on low, but it's probably a lot less than that. But as long as you have additional uh, batteries, then you can run this thing all day and let other batteries charge as you're using this. So it's a free flex mobility uh, gussets, which I like that. So you, you don't feel like you're tugging on anything. And it is wind and water resistant. It has a five times longer lifetime because of the material. And so three times faster heating, which yeah, this, this, uh, this coat is amazing. And of course, like I said, you could charge up your, your mobile device with this type of charger, which you could get this separately as well for like 40, 50 bucks. I'd rather have this than the bigger M12 unit. And there is a life indicator right there on how full the battery actually is. as this has three bars and so yeah all right so all right so obviously like this fits this oh my god all right so obviously this fits extremely well i love the i love the way that the material is all right so so this uh so i got a large this feels good it, it seriously is it fits perfectly and the whole point of me getting this is because uh, our winters are harsh. Uh, I live in Illinois, in northern Illinois. And so this is going to actually be my undercoat for this jacket. Perfect. Perfect, and th that's and so this that that's what I'm going to use the M12 uh, hard shell jacket for is because now this is going to be good enough with, with the heat. It's going to be good enough to be in like a negative 10, negative 17 degree weather when it comes to what I need to do outside, when it comes to the driveway or work on whatever I got to work on, or just be just be out and about. And so this thing is awesome. So what we are going to do is we are actually going to. Heat this up and let's see on how uh, how hot this actually gets. I do have a fully uh, I do have a fully charged two amp hour battery because that's what it comes with. Now, when it comes to batteries, like I said, I do not recommend you use the the bigger batteries when it comes to the three, four, and six because you're gonna feel this on your side when you sit down in a seat. I do wish that Milwaukee would actually put the battery in the front, about right here or right here because this is where you're going to be uh, sitting down on a seat or you're in your car on the way to work and that actually gets in the way a little bit. You got to make sure that it's not pressing up against the back of the seat. So I do wish Milwaukee put the battery in front. When it comes to the charger, all right, so the top is the on and off button and it also has the in, the input for the power. And I think it also has a light indicator on the charge. All right, and so for the, the underneath, if this is the USB out. So you could use this one to charge up your whatever device you want to charge up, pretty much just your phone or headphones or whatnot. And so, yeah, so that's actually a good feature to have. It's a small charger, portable, and it stays with your hoodie. So that's awesome. I'm so glad that they give you this one instead of the big M12 unit when it comes to the charger. I like this one a lot better. But already, let's take a look at the inside. The inside is awesome now. Like I said, the M12 hoodie sucks. The M12 hoodie sucks. This actually is a really good coat. I love this coat. All right, so you just go to the back. Here is the mount, just like that. You just go to the, the DC out right here. Now that's connected. Now inside, inside that there is a pouch for this right here. Just slide that in like so, then you're good to go. Close that. Let's actually turn this on now. This is the, the on and off right here. Yeah, see, so white, blue, and red. Red, white, and blue. So this thing retails for $169. That's not bad for the jacket, battery, charger, and a USB cable to be able to keep yourself warm during the winter when you're working outside. Now, to me, that is 100% worth it. 
And I, I am going to stay warm this year inside this garage and outside. And whatever I'm doing outside, I'm staying warm. Now, the M12 hoodie kept me warm, but the, just the build quality of the hoodie is it's garbage compared to the M12 jacket. And so, yeah, so I, I do not recommend the hoodie at all. According to the farmer's forecast, it's supposed to be a harsh winter. So you got to get ready for it. So that's pretty much it. If you found this video helpful, please like this video and please hit the bell button to be notified of future videos. And please subscribe to the channel. This is Dave and Nicholas. Thank you for tuning in and I'll see you guys next time.